the five things about work at least my work so these are just gonna be the five things that really just piss me off when having to go to work uh before we get started if you guys have any ideas that you want me to talk about just put them in the comments i'll definitely respond to them and heart them if i do do them shut you out all that kind of stuff and to keep in mind i i, I work at a grocery store so yeah if you guys didn't know that grocery store number one stock rotation slash date rotation more so the date rotation because stock rotation i don't give a shit date rotation so i work in perishables which is the frozen section and like the fridges so like milk and uh butters and all that and obviously the freezers you know the frozen vegetables ice cream all that kind of stuff so the freezers we don't actually have to uh date rotate them because they last literally fucking forever basically the fridges however th those items go off they go off in like a couple months usually so we had to rotate the dates and all and when i tell you i hate date rotations because half the time the product that needs to be rotated and i have no idea if this is just by chance the the thing that needs to be rotated has like 20 billion items and it's always the small items that needs to be date rotated instead of like those big tubs of like yogurt it'll just be like those little square bloody cheeses that has like 50 of them in there and so you have to pull out the whole row just to put your like 10 small ass cheeses in there you have to put them all back so not only does it just annoy me because it just takes way longer F the fridge section takes so much longer to do because obviously our uh, stuff comes on pallets we get them off we usually do frozen first that's way faster because you don't have to date rotate then you get to the fridges you only have like two or three pallets but it takes forever because there's so many little items you have to pull off the shelf put in and if you don't the damn manager's like why aren't you putting the goddamn shit on the why aren't you rotating but the fuck because I don't fucking want to, man. It's like 50 items on that shit. And then you'll just like be like, ah, oh, fine, I won't put it on the shelf. And then they're just like, why didn't you put it on the shelf? Well, there's 50 fucking items. I didn't want to put it on the goddamn shelf because it's going to take fucking forever. Then fuck that. Sorry if that was a bit loud. But um, as you can see, date rotation is garbage. I know why we should do it, and I do do it, it's just really annoying to me. Anyway, my next point, Karens. We all know what a Karen is, We've probably all experienced Karen, you might even know a Karen. And if you do, tell them to fuck off, just to please, just, you know, for me, just help, help brother out, help a brother out, and tell those cousins the fuck off because when i tell you karen's i don't know what the guy version of karen is i don't know maybe um fucking billy bob i don't know billy bob karen and billy bob tell them just piss off because there's been so many times there's some there's such assholes not even half the time just every time i remember this guy uh this guy kept calling um calling for me so they came over he was, he was just like oh, oh do you have this on do you have this on i'm just like uh no and it's, it's not even in my department so he was asking for bakery item i'm by the i'm in the freezers so what the fuck would i know if anything's there he's asking for bakery item and it's like eight or nine o'clock so obviously the bakery you know the bakery section of the grocery store is closed and he's like, do you have this? And I showed him through the whole section to ensure that there's definitely, this item definitely isn't there. I checked in the back. He saw me go to the back. We checked all over the, the all over the aisle. And guess what this prick says? Oh, what a waste of time then. The fuck do you mean? Oh, wait. Waste of time. 
Ah, oh, gee. You fucking waste of my goddamn time walking around with your fucking old ass, slow ass. Bloody about to have fucking dementia ass, you bloody stroller walking ass. Like, what the fuck? What the fuck you mean? Oh, what a waste of time. Ah, oh, fuck, bro. You don't have much time. You don't have much time left. You shouldn't be wasting any time. Like, get the hell out of the damn store, man. Walk all over the store to help you do your shopping list, and all you say, oh, what a waste of fun. What a prick. Number three. The music sucks at supermarkets. Now, in New Zealand, I do not know about your country. I'm specifically talking about my country, New Zealand. Most of the grocery stores have a playlist on Spotify of pre-approved songs that can play in Pakistan because you don't want songs that are, you know, not appropriate. There's, there's I mean, there's been a couple of times in the supermarket that songs that they have played and it's not gone good. So you don't want an appropriate songs to play. So with, with these pre-proof lists, I swear they do not, there's only like a normal, a holiday, there's only like normal and holiday, like, um, uh, like just not, when I say normal, I just mean just any day or any month that just doesn't have any like holiday, like Christmas and Halloween or Easter, normally just Christmas though, Christmas is the big one where we change. Obviously, you got like Mariah Carey and all those kind of songs, Christmas theme songs. But every other month, basically, they just play the certain playlist that just plays every time you come to the supermarket. If you go to the same supermarket, let's say about five times, I bet, you, and you stay for, okay, let's see, your, let's say your average time to shop is an hour. If you come five times over a couple of weeks, well, let's just say, a month you know a month and uh a month and you know shop for an hour so you come basically every week uh to do your shopping let's say you take an hour you know you take it a bit longer um if you if you pay attention if you have like a handbook notepad or anything you write down the songs that you hear i'm telling you at least 80 percent of the songs will be the like just like you'll get the same songs 80 percent of the time you'll go down the list and there'll be like 50 of like four songs and then maybe like three of like four other songs you barely the playlist that they use must be so damn short because when i tell you it packs that my new store the new store that i work at i've heard the same song i know all the damn songs i've listened to these songs so fucking much that I dread them. You do not. If you love a song, you will not love it. If it's in, you will no longer love it. If it's in the, you know, in the pre approved supermarket list of songs, trust me, <laughs> this will test you if you actually like a song because you're going to hear it like at least a good 10 times every single day every single day and you better love that song because if you don't truly love that song you're gonna start to dread it you're gonna start to hate it every fiber of your being is gonna want to hurl the speakers at anything at cars outside you're gonna just want to just have no music i'm not even sure everyone like that works at my store as soon as they turned off the music inside the store we didn't notice because we had like when you work there so much you just had to you know block it out it's just background noise so but once we noticed it we breathed a sigh of fresh air because it sucks and i'm sorry do you know i'm sorry if i'm yelling a bit but okay it's frustrating i'm sorry number four 
the thermostat must be broken because constantly and I am telling you constantly I will go to work and for some reason it would be a different temperature every time I go into this bloody store I come into the store one time cuz he it's like 30 degrees it feels like Australian sun if you've ever been to Australia or New Zealand where your ozone layer is fucked so instead of you know the ozone layer protecting you from the sun rays you get beamed straight by the sun basically our ozone layer is so weak it burns it fucking burns you don't know burning until you get burnt by an Australian or NZ sun it's either gonna be the dry ass Sahara desert hot as hell or you know the next day you come come in and all of a sudden you're in a different co continent called Alaska it's fucking freezing it's not cold for, I love the cold I love the cold you know because I can warm up fast but why the fuck is the thermostat going up and down it's like it's like that dynamic of like the father having like the thermostat at you know a certain degree super hot and everyone in the house wants to turn it down and it's just like every other day someone turns it up the father turns it you know turns it up hot then next day sun comes turns it down to cold next day fucking dad comes and turns it back to hot back forward back forward back it's annoying and i'm sick of having to change my gear like bro i come back and i have to have some bloody i might as well bring fucking ski goggles get ready to ski cuz uh oh, frozen fucking frozen cuz I'm by the freezers but before I even get into the store I would have been frozen over fucking Anna visit fucking bro it's be part of a Disney movie bro frozen ah. and my final point I want to make number five the last point of my top five worst things about work going to work it's self-explanatory uh yeah going to work i, I just i, I, I want to do anything else gym go hang out with friends hang out with the girlfriend fucking make videos do anything so yeah number five going to work well if you guys want me to talk about anything else any topics put it down in the comment section i hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh make sure to give a like comment subscribe if you did it really helps me in the algorithm and uh yeah love you peace